Hi, Pam here. This is an update video of what's going on with me now after the fire uh, because uh, somebody had asked me that in a comment. Uh, a couple questions. So I'm going to do my best to address some of that on this video. And uh, I wanted it mostly to be positive and be out in some lovely scenery while I'm sharing it with you. So, stay tuned here and uh, I'll fill you in a little bit. So, since this is an update video, I will be sharing at a later date the actual story and how I escaped. So, the building that was on fire was a rental property that I own. So, it was through my family, how I have it originally, because I, I wouldn't have bought a rental property initially like that. Uh, that building was six units, and I lived in it myself, so I was able to oversee it. And... Just across the yard, I had another building. Uh, there was an apartment there, and underneath it was my fitness studio, the one where I do the workout videos. So, prior to this fire, I had seen a realtor because I have been wanting to sell this property for many, many years. So, at least for now, obviously the fire put a wrench in it as far as selling my property the way I had wanted. And as far as my coverage and insurance, of course I had insurance for my building. I always did. And there was a time, um, several, several years ago, I had coverage for my own personal belongings as well. However, I had had some trouble with the apartment. Um, as I said, the neighborhood had gotten bad, and it was hard to get good tenants who had good credit. Uh, and in the past, when I made the mistake and took a chance when they asked me to, I always got burned, meaning... They didn't pay me, and they did destroy my building, and I'd have to repair it. So, but that's neither here nor there. So, there was a period of time I had a lot of vacancies, but I still had to pay all the same expenses for the unit. And I lowered my coverage. That's when I did it. That's when I stopped coverage for my personal belongings. So, where on my present day? So... I had coverage for the building for fire, no coverage for my personal belongings, and no coverage for the rents. That is my income, a large, uh, a large part of my income. I don't have coverage for that either. And uh, guess what? It's okay. Because I'm not worried. Because, remember, uh, whenever I get the money, which... Who knows how long that'll take. I'll figure it all out then with some help. You know, in order to sell the place and to get out of here. I'll get by in the meantime and uh, I'm not worried about it. I'm really not. It'll all take care of itself. But uh, right now I have a lot of work. I mean, everything in my apartment was ruined. Except for some clothes in my bedroom, which is good. But like anything else in any part of the house, the furniture is all destroyed. Uh, everything covered in black soot. And even when I do get an item from my bedroom, it's a lot of things are black. And it's so hard. It's a lot of work trying to clean it. It's so much work. But uh, that'll all work itself out. And, you know, I don't have a mailbox. And I'm living at my mom's. And just crazy stuff, you know. But, uh, yeah, a lot of stuff going on at this time. Oh, that's so pretty out there, isn't it? 
very lovely. Anyway, with all the other stuff, I know it'll be fine. I'm really not, honestly, I'm not dwelling on those things. So, I'm not crying about that at all. I mean, it can be very stressful because there's so many things. Uh, that part of my life's not ordinary, but that that's going to work itself out. That'll get easier as time goes on, and I know that. We all have stressful times, all of us, you know? We all have things that we go through, all of us. You know, I'm, everybody has stuff. There's people, I'm sure, that have it worse than I've. I have it. I know, in fact, I know there are. You know, so uh, just um, being real and just sharing about my pets uh, because, you know, I did do the cat videos so you know about my pets I have a lot of videos of, of them and uh, I think that's why I shared that with you had I not done cat videos, I wouldn't have but uh, they were um, a part of my YouTube channel anyway I mean, I will say that I am, that is hard on me. So it's more on my downtime, alone time, quiet time. When I'm really busy with all the stuff I have to do, I'm not thinking about them, but I can't look at their videos. <laughs> I can't watch that now. Because they're so cute, and they're so cute, you know? And uh, it's that cuteness that I can't see right now, you know? Because I miss their presence. But I'll tell you what, I know they had a really good cat life with me. That I feel really good about. Uh, I gave them so much attention. They were never neglected with attention, great food, buying toys and giving them a happy home. And I'm so happy about that. So I'm happy I gave animals a good home and I know they know it up there. So anyway. I will be fine, it's just it's gonna take me time with the cat stuff, you know what I mean? And uh, I appreciate you listening, because I did the videos on them. So, I want to get my composure here on this new clip, I don't want to be crying the whole time. Um, but here's what it does, like, I get triggered. So I'm on my YouTube channel and I'm scrolling down and then I'll see my thumbnail picture of my cats. And then all of a sudden it triggers and it depresses me. Then I start thinking about them. It's so hard to get away from it, you know? And then I have cat pictures on my phone and then you don't want to delete them. And I scroll and then I see them, see their picture, and then I feel depressed and very sad. And uh, I don't know what to do about all that. It's really hurtful. It really is hurtful. It takes me a long time to get over my pets. This wouldn't be the first time. Unfortunately, it's just the first time too soon after two years ago when my other cat of older age you know, died Jonah, and then I got these young cats, and they weren't very old, and to lose two in one time. Anyway, I'm not going to start crying again. So, today is July 18th, and this will be the next video I'm going to put out. Um, it's just um, to let you know what's going on. And it's not that I don't want to heal and get over this. It's only been 10 days since it happened. But I will have one last video because I think it's important. And that will be the actual day of the fire. I will be like talking about it and tell you exactly what happened. Because I shouldn't be living and that is the truth. It was a miracle. And um, I think it's good for me to get it out. I guess for those that don't want to hear it, that's okay. I have, I'm fine with that. I understand. Um, but, uh, and then after that, I want to be done with it. 
So, of course, I will get other cats. I don't know, one or two. I usually get two because I like, I just like their interaction. But I, you know, like you feel like a sense of guilt, like I'm replacing them. But I'm not. You know what I mean? I'm not. How can you replace them? How can you replace what you loved? You can't. Sorry. You can't do it. But what happened happened. It wasn't what I wanted. There were only two. Jamin wasn't even two yet. So I lost two at once. What can you do? They're gone. But they're in heaven. But they're gone. But they're up there. I'm not going to see them till later. And, uh, <laughs> you know, so, I don't know, but you do feel a sense of guilt. Even though it's not, there, there can be no replacement. They're all different, but I don't have a choice. I have no choice. So, I don't know when that will be, but when I do, it'll make me happy, I know that. But I have to be settled. And I don't know if it'll be when I'm temporarily living here in my building or when I've actually moved sold my place and gotten out I'm not sure how long all that's gonna take so it might have to be before I don't know but anyway you'll know you'll know so you'll know when I start doing cat videos and uh, in the meanwhile please forgive me until I can watch your cat videos it hurts me too much I love your pets but, but what it does, it just reminds me of what I lost right now, you know? And if your pets passed on, I would be so upset too, because I love animals, you know? So, yeah. So, thank you so much. And, uh, we'll see you soon.